The Tales of Xavier Kingston, Part 3, The Retribution. Juan Kingston, a member of KOB and brother of Xavier Kingston, was working at Clumpo's pawn shop like many do. It was a normal day until two members of GOP came in and robbed Quan out of his chain. After Quan was robbed, he went behind the pawn shop to cry to himself. After Quan pulled himself together, he went over to the Schaffer units, where KOB resides. Quan went inside and told Xavier what happened and asked for help. <laughs> After the three spoke, Xavier and Jason went to their safe to get geared up for the shootout. When Xavier and Jason were geared up to kill, all that was left to do was to kill them. The robbers were repping the color green so it was obvious where they stayed at, Janie's homes. So, Xavier and Jason made their way over to Janie's homes to get their retribution.
while the shooting was ongoing, Quan tried to call his girlfriend, but she didn't answer. Quan did not know where she was until Xavier called him up. Quan hastily made his way over to Janice Holmes to see what happened. What he saw broke Quan on the inside. After Quan saw what happened, he was devastated. No words could express the depth of his heartbreak. He felt as if he had lost everything and had nothing left to live for. Quan's will was shattered and frustration consumed him, leaving him feeling utterly lost and alone. After leaving Janice Holmes, Xavier, Jason, and Quan drove to Schaffer to drop Quan off. After leaving Janice Holmes, Xavier, Jason, and Quan drove to Schaffer to drop Quan off. While Quan was left at home, Xavier and Jason went over to their usual hangout spot, the boxing club.
Xavier and Jason shortly called 911 for help after they saw his lifeless body. The emergency services arrived and they put Quan in a body bag. Xavier and Jason were broken, just how Quan was. This was a loss that could never be forgotten, no matter how much they wished they could brush it off. After emergency services left, Xavier and Jason left the apartment to get a fresh breath of air, and it felt as if a big weight was lifted off their shoulders. Oh, my God.